you have and closing for a new construction or a builder built home or a condo coming up but do you know how much you need to budget for closing costs it is not as straightforward as a purchase of an existing or a resale home please educate yourself to avoid last minute surprises that can derail your purchase as a homeowner you will encounter various fees that can quickly add up uh, let's break it down First up is the land transfer fee. This is the tax with provincial and possibly city components on the purchase of a land or property. If you're buying in the city of Toronto, it is almost double of what you would pay elsewhere in Ontario. Thankfully, there is a rebate if this happens to be your first home. Development levies are charged by the builder on behalf of the city to fund community amenities and infrastructure. The amount varies depending on the location and the type of the property. Some builders may cap, cap this amount to avoid any surprises uh, to the buyers. Uh, property tax adjustments um, are usually, uh, when you buy a new construction home, your property taxes will be adjusted based on city's assessment, the closing date, and the tax billing cycle. Legal fees are expenses charged uh, regarding the purchase of the home, and it is usually charged by your lawyer. Maintenance fee adjustments. Uh, builders will charge uh, maintenance fees in common areas and uh, community amenities, usually called as condo fee. Some builders may offer a rebate or cashback depending on the period of occupancy uh, before closing. HST and uh, rebate. <clears throat> All buyers of new homes uh, that you purchase from builders, uh, you must pay HST. Uh, this is about, uh, this is actually 13% of the purchase price. The confusion arises on when the rebate on the HST is available. For owner occupied homes, the builder is usually able to claim HST on your behalf. And so you don't have to fork up that amount at the time of closing. For investment properties, however, the buyer has to claim the HST. Uh, post closing um, and there are certain specific rules to be followed and that is where the differences arise so the question is how i am of help in this regard the good part is when working with me you can expect an 80 to 90 percent accurate estimate of what your closing costs are going to be because i study your purchase in detail this way you can avoid any last minute surprises that you are not planned for when you get the official statement from your lawyer. Remember, when buying a new construction home, understanding closing costs is very crucial. By being prepared, you can avoid unexpected expenses and make informed decisions throughout your home buying journey. Reach out to me to know more. Thank you.